Kia Maori, feels guilty, about split custody with ex Corey Hardrick exclusive. Tia Maori, beloved actress, entrepreneur, and television personality, has long been a source of inspiration for her fans. Known for her breakthrough role in the classic sitcom Sister, Sister, her down-to-earth personality and relatable approach to family life have made her a household name. But recently, the 45-year-old actress has been navigating one of the most difficult chapters of her personal life, co-parenting her two children with her ex-husband, actor Corey Hardrick. In an exclusive interview with publication name Tia opened up about her emotional journey since her divorce from Corey, including her deep-seated feelings of guilt about their split custody arrangement. Despite both of them maintaining a united front in their efforts to be present for their children, Tia admits that the reality of split custody has been harder on her than she initially expected. I feel guilty, Tia confesses. It's a constant struggle for me. When my kids are with their dad, I feel like I'm missing out on moments. I'm trying to be the best mom I can be, but it's hard when you're not physically with your children all the time. A 14-year marriage, a difficult breakup. Tia and Corey Hardrick were married for 14 years before announcing their separation in 2022. The couple, who have two children together, Cree, 12, and Cairo, 5, seemingly had it all, a successful careers in Hollywood, a beautiful family, and a strong public presence. But after years of ups and downs, the two decided to part ways. Their separation was announced on Tia's social media in October 2022, when she posted a heartfelt message about their decision to go their separate ways while still remaining committed to their children. We will remain friends, co-parents, and we will continue to support each other in all that we do, she wrote at the time. The announcement came as a shock to many, especially given their public display of affection and family unity over the years. But as Tia reveals in this interview, the decision to separate was something that both she and Corey had been quietly working through for some time. Our marriage had run its course, Tia explains. We've been through so much together. But there comes a point when you realize that you're not the person you were when you first met. Sometimes, you grow together, sometimes, you grow apart. And that's what happened. Despite the heartache, Tia emphasizes that both she and Corey remain committed to co-parenting and ensuring their children's emotional well-being. While the public might view the split through a lens of sadness, Tia insists that they are both happier and healthier individually, even though the transition has been difficult for all involved. The realities of co-parenting, guilt, growth, and new norms. The most difficult aspect of Tia's new life is adjusting to the reality of co-parenting with split custody. While both she and Corey share joint custody, the emotional and logistical aspects of the arrangement have been challenging for Tia, particularly the moments when her children are with Corey. It's not easy, Tia admits. You try to balance everything, your career, your personal life, and you want to be there for your kids every single moment. But then, you have to let them go and trust that everything will be okay. I still struggle with that. I'll always be a mom who wants to protect my kids, but I have to accept that they need time with their dad too. Tia's guilt stems from the moments when her children are away from her. While she is deeply committed to her work, which includes acting, producing, and her expanding business ventures, she is also keenly aware of the emotional and developmental importance of her presence in her children's lives. I just want to be present for everything, the small moments, the big moments, but I can't always do that, she explains. And that's where the guilt comes in. Despite the emotional hurdles, Tia and Corey are united in their determination to put their children's well-being first. They both actively work to maintain a stable and loving environment for their children. Corey, who has also been vocal about the difficulties of navigating the co-parenting journey, regularly shares glimpses of their life with their kids on social media, which has further illustrated the mutual respect and collaboration they have in raising their children. We both love our kids more than anything, and they know that, Tia says. We're trying our best. It's just not always easy. A new chapter. Tia's personal growth and career focus. Post-divorce, Tia has found herself in a period of personal reflection and growth. Over the last year, she's taken steps to reintroduce herself to the world, focusing on her career and exploring new opportunities in the entertainment industry. From starring in new TV projects to launching a wellness brand, Tia is finding new ways to thrive professionally while adjusting to her new family dynamics. I've been so focused on my kids for so many years. Now, I'm learning to balance taking care of myself again, Tia shares. It's a journey. I'm learning that it's okay to take time for myself, to prioritize my mental health, to explore new passions. That's been something I've had to learn, especially in the midst of all the emotional changes. 
One of the key ways Tia has been focusing on her own well-being is through her advocacy for mental health and self-care. As a mother and a public figure, she feels a responsibility to share her struggles and lessons with others, particularly women who may be going through similar challenges. I want women to know it's okay to feel guilty, it's okay to have those moments of doubt, but you don't have to stay there, she says. You can grow through the pain. You can move forward, and you can still be strong and take care of yourself while caring for your children. Corey Hardrick's role in the co-parenting dynamic. Corey Hardrick, Tia's ex-husband, has also spoken about his role as a co-parent, emphasizing the importance of supporting Tia in her journey and making sure their children are shielded from the difficulties of the divorce. We both want the best for our kids, Corey shared in a recent interview. It's been tough, but I know that we're both committed to making this work for them. The couple's co-parenting approach is marked by mutual respect and clear communication, which has allowed them to transition more smoothly through the separation. They make sure to attend important family events together, such as their children's birthdays or school functions, showing that despite their personal differences, they remain united when it comes to being present for their children. We don't want our kids to feel like anything is missing, Corey continues. We'll always be a family, no matter what the circumstances are. We're in this together. Moving forward, hope for the future. As Tia continues to adjust to life after her split from Corey, she remains hopeful about what the future holds. While the guilt of co-parenting may never completely go away, Tia has learned to manage her emotions by focusing on the positive changes that have come from the transition. She emphasizes that healing, growth, and self-care are key components of her journey forward. The past year has been tough, but I feel like I'm becoming a stronger version of myself. I'm learning, I'm evolving, and I'm learning how to embrace this new chapter in my life, Tia reflects. I'm still a mom, I'm still a woman with dreams, and I'm excited to see where life takes me. Tia Maori's story of navigating life after divorce with Corey Hardrick serves as a powerful reminder that co-parenting, while challenging, can be done with love, respect, and a focus on the well-being of children. The emotional journey of motherhood, particularly in the context of a split family, is something that many can relate to, and Tia's openness about her struggles provides a sense of comfort to those facing similar challenges. Through it all, Tia remains a loving mother, a committed professional, and a woman finding her own path, one step at a time.